SW Girls. Today we're sponsored by Folks Middle School with our Comparing Elements Lab. Yay! So here's our first box. Let's go ahead and unwrap it. And we have aluminum. So here's aluminum. And aluminum has a metallic luster. Do you see that shine? Let's see if it is conductive. Does it conduct electricity? I don't know, we're gonna do it this way. See how that light comes on? That means it is a good conductor. Is it magnetic? Let's find out. Here's our magnet. Nope, it is not magnetic. Is it malleable? Well, it's pressed into sheets, so it is malleable. Thank you, Folks Middle School. Hi, I'm the M in SMW, and we're here to look at our next delivery. Wonder what it is. Let's unbox it. I'm so excited. I've been waiting all day for this one. Look at this. This is carbon. If you look, it's not very shiny. It's kind of dull. So this would be non-metallic because it does not reflect light. Next up, conductivity. Don't try this at home. Super dangerous. Conductivity meter. Turn it on, engage. Oh no, it doesn't light up. There's no light in my life. So this is non-conductive. Magnetism, let's see if opposites attract. Here's my magnet. No magnetism. Now we look, does it look like we could bend this into sheets? Not very strong. This would be considered brittle because if we took and tried to hammer it, it would shatter into pieces, making it brittle. Hello, here is our next box. Let's see what's inside. We have this. So let's see, is it metallic? I do see some light reflecting, so it is metallic. So copper is metallic. Now let's get our conductivity meter. Is it conducting electricity? You can kind of see that light turning on. Let's try from a different angle. So it is conducting electricity. What about magnetism? There is no magnetic attraction. And if we look, it has been shaped flat and into a wave. So it is malleable. Welcome back, you guys. All right, we have a new box today. Let's see what's in it. Oh my God, it smells. Ooh. Oh, well that explains it. You guys, we have sulfur. Sulfur is really smelly, like really stinky. There we go, now you can see it. All right, so let's see. Does sulfur have any luster? Is it shiny? No, not really. So it is non-metallic. Let's see if there's any conductivity. Nope, no conductivity. All right, let's see, is it magnetic? Nope, not magnetic. And I bet if you were to hit this with a hammer, it would just break all over the place. So sulfur, all it is is smelly. 
Okay, Miss M is back. Just ran down the Amazon delivery guy and got a fresh box. Let's unwrap. So You should be very excited. We have nickel in the house. So let's go down our different properties. First, we're gonna test for luster. So we look to see if it can reflect light. We're like, wow. Did you ever do it where you get the get the light and you shine it and you make the little beam of light go in someone's eyes? Yeah, this would be awesome for that. So it'd be considered metallic. Then we got to test to see if it can conduct electricity. Kind of like a lightning storm. All right, turn it on. Let's hope for the best. Oh, you kind of see that light? Pretty awesome. Conducts electricity. So it is conductive. Now we're gonna take our magnet and test for magnetism. Can it do it? Yes, it is magnetic, awesome. Malleable, now obviously we did not get this out of the ground like this. So it had to been pressed through a machine and formed into a thin sheet, making it malleable. If I hit it more and more, it might get flatter and flatter. So malleable is the ability to shape it into thin sheets. I am just opening up and we see our piece of iron. So even though iron is a little bit rusty, it does have a metallic luster. It is shiny. So let's look at our next part, which is conductivity. We have our meter, and it does conduct light. You can see that light. All right, now let's see if it is magnetic. Whoa, did we see that? Look how magnetic it is. And lastly, malleability. So you can see that iron is already in a thin sheet, so it is malleable. Dwayne the Rock Cycle Johnson here, going to introduce our last box. It's me, Miss Wilson. All right, you guys, we are going to open up our last box. Let's see what's in it. It doesn't smell, which is good. All right, we have zinc. Very nice, it is shiny. Tomatoa would love this from Moana. He would want it for his shell. All right, let's see if it conducts electricity. Oh yeah, look at that. Lots of conduction going on there. Is it magnetic? Man, didn't work. No magnetism. And last but not least, is it malleable? Yes, it is. Look at that thin sheet. Very lovely. Thank you for joining us today on our unboxing video. We will see you next time. I was hoping, I really was. Do I have any that was magnetic? I don't think so. So, is it magnetic? <laughs> I can cut that part, it's fine.